on. Fair enough. Fair. We are going on a little kind of a day trip, just like an evening trip kind of. It's 1.30. It is Saturday and we are going out to a place called Deep Cove. We've had a very good week. Well, I had two bad mood days and I had like heart palpitations in my chest. So can that still be a good week? If I thought I was having a heart attack. It was right here, I felt my pulse. Very unusual. Um, Donna, Emer, and Laura were over from home with like some of their college friends and we met them a few times and it was delicious. We have the last night of the fireworks tonight so. Anything else? All Ireland tomorrow. All Ireland tomorrow. Women's football this morning. We went for our first run together this morning. We are sporty queens. And yeah, we are on the way. Look at the bridge. Wow. What are you going to say, Connor? Emer, it's okay. Emer, don't worry. It's sturdy enough, I'd say. Molly also did the bar this week on Monday and Tuesday and went to Taylor Swift last night. I'm not even that happy for her. She got right where you left me with that Aaron Dzinger guy as well. Like what an unbelievable surprise song. When I go to her, I hope I get Better Than Revenge. Maybe Pictures of Burn, me and Louise used to love that back in the day. Yeah, I'm gonna stop watching videos on TikTok of her because I want it to be a surprise when I see her because I feel like it'll be like a year and a half now when we see her. I think it'll be next fall. Um, what else do we want to say? No, I'm taking it right here. Right? Oh, I better check the directions. I have to give Gunner directions now, so I will just take a few clips. This is probably going to be like a five minute vlog, but it's not kind of nice sometimes. It's not Gunner. Do you know what takes ages? Editing. It takes me feckin' ages. I wouldn't be very good at that now. Anyway, bye everyone! Bye guys! Connor has gone for a walk. I hate vlogging in public. Connor's gone for a walk. I am trying to tan my back because I've only tanned my front. But I'm getting a nice colour, so I'm probably going to end up napping, to be honest. I like it here. I love how quiet it is in comparison to the city. We're always going to be country folk at heart, you know? Look at my view, like. Why is it that any of these places that are... <laughs> so there's one out there. That's him with the blue shorts. Y'all know. I would never do that. Because the last time I did something like that was when we were all hammered in Boston. We were after being on the tiki boat, we had about six Trudies each and then we swam out there, remember? And I was like, I'm drowning! I was like spluttering away and Molly was like, just stand up! I stood up, it was up to my like hip.
like I mean healthy, but I'm getting that for my alcohol spurts. Not how much of these. Um, <laughs> we are making some bulgas. We are going to actually, I was going to get a sushi, but I'm very proud of us that we didn't because we're saving our cash dollar bills. We got oven chips instead of usually ordering in. Mmm, they're just all those chips. Yeah. They might crisp up. Put the chicken. Mm -mm -mm. Open for business. Are they going to get overdone? We just found out that the Prosecco is resealable. How about how you open it? Mm. Standing in the fair way, look, Donna and her friends got us these. They look actually, they actually lasted because the apartment's so hot. Usually flowers don't, well, the one bouquet I got. <gasps> Holy, <laughs> pardon me. Well done, Connor. Woo! Okay, everyone, let's make Aperol spritz. It's my first time making one. Have you made them in the hotel, Connor? No, there we go. First ingredient, and some would say the most important, is ice. I'm going to go with three ice cubes. Do you mind me using that, Connor? So that's three ice cubes. What people do in bars is go like this, isn't it, Connor? Freezes your glass. Is it? Then we have some orange circles which we have put in the freezer. Oh, Connor. Yes, orange circles that you put in the freezer. <laughs> so now I'm going to do it. Let's just do it for taste and for strength. So we have our Prosexy, we have our Aperol, and then we have sparkling water, which isn't soda water, but apparently the only difference is the soda water is more sparkly. So I'm going to start with the Aperol, then I can like make it to the colour that like normal Aperols are, or do you start with Prosecco? Oh, there's instructions. Good idea. You go up ice plus Prosecco Aperol Soda. So let's go Prosecco first. Do you know that enough? Wait, it tells you like ratio. So a lot of Prosecco. So I'm gonna go this much Prosecco. Just listen to the buzz. Okay. Then we are going Aperol. I think like a small bit less. Oh wow, actually I want full glass, so I'm gonna go more of everything. I feel like probably Kira Brennan if she watches this will give out to me because she's a bartender. And if she doesn't snap me about that sentence then she doesn't watch them and she's a fake friend. Okay, after all sparkling water. Cost us four dollars. This is just like a dash. Okay, she's more orange than usual. This looks really good, you know, Connor. I'm trying to have a taste. Okay, test. Ooh. It needs more of something, Connor, but I don't know what it is. What does it need more of? Prosecco. 
Það er hún rækar þannig. Success! Þess er að kóli með þér. Do you ever just like picture your hands slicing your finger off and just like cringe? Mmm! Mmm! You know the words this song. Sing along. Sing along. When you know the words this song. Sing along. Sing along. I one of those memories you want. Sing along. <laughs> I didn't. I heard. I heard you were slipping tequila. Is that the one? Is that the song you're thinking of, though? <laughs> Oh, it's a video, but cute! Oh, Barrett.